Today is Tuesday, October 23rd, and you're watching an SCW News Digest. A flyer has created quite the controversy here in Stockton. This flyer has been posted on many social media pages in town. As you can see, it advertises a Halloween event happening this weekend at the Stockton Rural Cemetery. The flyer reads in part, quote, This tour is not for the faint of heart. Join if you dare. Many Stocktonians wrote on social media that the festival and tour of the dead is disrespectful to the families of the people buried there. The manager of the cemetery says that they will make a decision this week as to whether or not they will cancel the tour. They say that they meant no disrespect. Tonight, Lotto Fever has swept the nation. Millions have bought their Mega Million tickets, hoping that they could be the next billionaire. And yes, that's billionaire with a B. The Lotto drawing price for tonight has gone up to $1.6 billion. Now, of course, the $1.6 billion would be paid out over 29 years or $904 million in cash. Except that final total won't likely apply to you. A math professor at Quinnipiac University in Connecticut has noted that the chances of winning is the same as the chances of rolling a die and getting won 11 times in a row. The exact chances of winning are 1 in 302.5 million, just 20 million shy of the population of the United States. The deadline for the Mega Million ticket buying is 745 in California, but some places stop selling them even earlier than that. The drawing for the Mega Million is held at 8 p.m. Pacific time. And if you do win, please remember the news anchor who told you about the deadlines and of the odds. <laughs> we'll have more news after this. Hi, this is Wayne Richardson coming to you from Stockton, and we we'll serve the homeless of San Joaquin County. If you know somebody who needs help, please refer to us. Also, we covet your prayers and financial support. If you want to volunteer, please contact us. God bless you. In today's Decision 2018 update, we are introducing you to the candidates for Stockton Unified Trustee Area 6 and 7. In Area 6, incumbent Angela Phillips will be going against Michael Jones Jr., parent and a restaurant administrator, and Scott McBrien, a teacher. For Area 7, Aaron Ann Edwards, a child development counselor with a history in local sports, will go against Dee Johnson, a retired principal whose purpose is towards student achievement, and Calendaria Vargas, a parent and a child advocate who seeks to modernize district policies. Information for today has come from the California State Library, the San Joaquin County Registrar of Voters Office, and different public record documents. Stay tuned for our Decision 2018 update tomorrow for more information on the Lincoln Unified Trustee Air Races. Thank you for watching this SCW News Digest. I'll see you again here tomorrow.